Hi, I'm Paul, pastor for Colton Community Church. This is day 23 in our Advent series. Today's video is going to be just a little bit different as we take and enter into the sanctuary. And as we enter into the sanctuary, we're going to begin to notice. Notice that there are lights on the floor of the sanctuary. Lights on the floor of the sanctuary pointing in a direction, pointing us to a purpose. And so let's follow the lights and see where they lead. You know, the book of Hebrews says that we have been surrounded by such a great cloud of witnesses. And so these lights represent the different witnesses in our life. Some of them have been bright. Some of them have been bright and some of them, you know, God has used those who are not shining as bright in our life. And this is a story of our, of our life as well. Sometimes we we walk in the brightness of God's word and we're passionate about what he has to say and other times, other times there are, are barely a flicker, barely a flicker, just a little bit of light coming off of us. And so we continue down this journey. We continue walking because we're faithful. We've been walking with God for a long time. We've been illuminating the light. And notice that the light is only so bright. There's only so much light being shed by those candles. And then all of a sudden we take a turn. Our path takes a turn. The purpose in our life takes a turn. We weren't anticipating it, but because we follow God's word, we take a turn. And as we take a turn, sometimes there are difficulties, and sometimes it works well. Sometimes there are difficulties, and sometimes it works well. And, and all of a sudden, we notice, we notice that things are beckoning us. Other things start to beckon us. They start to call us. And we've got the glory of the tree and all of its light saying, come, come here. We've got the beauty of the wreath. It's saying, come, come here. But neither one of those or the path in which you are to follow. Neither one of those are the direction in which you are to go. You must return back to the path that God has put in you, his purpose. And all of a sudden, you start to have direction again. You start to have meaning. You start to understand. You start to see clearly. And you walk along the path. Each a cloud witness. Each a person gone before you. Each person pointing the way. The way not to the tree. The way, not to the, the wide road that leads to destruction. No, it points in between. And you got to go up and you make the ascent. And you make the ascent to the cross. December 23rd is about the ascent to the cross. It's about the meaning and the purpose. Not the glitter, not the wrapping. It is about the fact that our Savior came for us and he died for us. All right, remember that as you get caught up in the dinner plans and the celebrations and the family and the presents, remember the cross. All right, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.